Yeah, we're, uh, we're investigating the dead body. Yes, I hope you enjoyed this one. This is Southern Analysis Gamer. We are now to boot an episode of 448 Comrades right now. Uh, I, I also, uh, yeah, I'd like to say that, that these chapter, these uh, episodes, you know, these fillers, they're, they're, I know we've seen them all before. This is just a rewrite. But I gotta admit, I like them, even though some people, you know, hate this, you know, hate this filler. And we already, and right now I'm also saying, but I do like them, and we already got word that the filler is going to end in around March. So, like, one more month and we're done. Um, and I don't mind, you know, sticking it out for a little longer. Anyway, the situation is this. Naruto, you know, being trapped in his nine tails form and sealed away, it's very problematic, you know. It's definitely very problematic. The situation for them is, like, very dire because the village is struggling, and, and everybody... However, it costs it with Naruto on the berserk, or on the berserk with his in his nine tail, and his in his nine tailed form. Like it, it, it even affected Kushina, who had the other half of the nine tails. The yin. I mean, remember the pop. Remember her. The nine tails is split into two pieces: the yin and the yang. Kushina has the yin. Naruto has the yang half. Uh, so basically, it, it's in two pieces. That's the pieces. So, however, because of the disturbance in the chakra nature, each year, it caused a, a Naruto's transformation. It's caused, you know, uh, it's causing feedback to the other nine, nine tails inside of Kushina. So right now, Kushina has to do her best, you know, uh, to understand the situation, you know, try to understand, try to, you know, to you know, help her son. And and everybody right now is worried. Like they're all worried. I mean, Naruto's been sealed. You know, the village, everybody's struggling. Seeing the look on Choji's face as he's struggling, as they're all trying to keep the wall on the inside of the village from collapsing in on them, you know, it's definitely, you know, definitely, you know, a tough, you know, in a bit, they're in a bind. I'm going to say it flat out, they're in a bind. So, you know, oh, and Shigamaru, he can't, and Shigamaru and the others, they can't do nothing. In Sakura, all she can do is like heal Hinata, you know, after what she went through, who with pain, you know. Right now they're in. A, not right now they're in a tough spot. You no. Know? Uh, however, things get you know, you know, getting interesting. You know, Naruto he's begging for more power. There's a part of him that wants more power, more of the Nine Tails power. But the Nine Tails, he's even struck. But even the Nine Tails thinking that he's a, 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 in way over his head. Because normally in the earlier, in, in the originals, the Nine Tails would just feed him power over and over again. You know, you know hoping that one day when he does, when he when he's strong enough, he would destroy the seal and one day be completely resurrected and take over Naruto's body. But now, over the years, he's, it looks like he seems hesitant there. In fact, he, I mean, he knows that Naruto has gone crazy. There's a part of him that can sense what's going on, you know. And he's in way over his head and Naruto, you know, of feeling the situation, in the situation in this situation, you know. He's right now in a bind. But the one person that reassures him to try to help him to calm down, his mother. I mean, think about it. Who, what better to know that, who could calm down, who better to calm down a child who is angry than their own parent? I mean, I mean that's pretty much self-explanatory. You, you understand what I'm talking about, right? I'm wondering, like, now she's trying to understand, not to try to get him to calm down, relaying to him that everybody, they're still alive, you know, and even trying to relay that Hinata is all right, you know. Trying to do her best to calm down her son, you know. Uh, she even tries to tell him that, and tell him that, and that you are strong. Like trying to reassure him that you, are, and reassure him that you are that, that she is his precious son. You are our precious son, mine and Minato's, house, you know, and that he is the child of prophecy, which Jiraiya, you know, foretold about. You know, the child of prophecy that will bring about great change in the ninja world. You know, we all know about that. <clears throat> I mean, that's a big deal. A very, very big deal. You know. No, but right now, they're in the... Right now, they're buying... Right now, it's... Now, they're, you know... You understand, you know. Oh, and, but Naruto, he wants power. And right now, his mother, he... He's there to, She's there to give him the hand that she needs. With her half of the nine tails. I mean, I mean think about it. And each of them, they both have enough power. Even them, they even though they both have half the power of the Nine Tails, that is a lot of power. So, what I imagine if the power would unite and make whole? It's kind of like how Minato was able to act his Nine Tails chakra mode, even though he was, 
you know, he was an Edo Tensei and you know, reanimated Shinobi, he still had half of the Ninth Hill sealed up inside of him, which means he could access the power. That kind of made him a Shinshuriki a little bit, even though he died. You know, it's understandable. Anyway, the power, anyway, the power that Naruto receives is enough. He manages to, he manages to gain control of himself and break free of the Nine Tails, Tails state. And now he's activated Nine Tails Chakra Mode, a uh, golden chakra mode, uh, you know, kind of mode. Uh, and he is, and I like, I, and I, I gotta admit, this, this is one of my favorite forms of Naruto when he goes full on Nine Tails Chakra Mode. Because, you know, it's definitely. You know, it's definitely the best, one of the best versions of Naruto. I gotta admit my number one, ver I gotta admit my, it's one of my top picks between uh, this mode, Sage mode, and, and Tail Beast mode, you know, that, that's one of my favorites. And Tail Beast Sage mode beats, you know, Six Pass mode, that's the, um, his most powerful, that's my favorite, you know. Mm. You know, well, definitely, it's definitely very, it's good, it's definitely, you know, very, I can't, I mean, and he took out Pain, he took out Naga, Nagiko, uh, you know, Tendo Pain in, in just a few moments, you know. I wish the fight was a little longer, but remember, this is filler, and they're just skipping all the, they're just skipping all the crazy, all the, most of the stuff, because we already seen it before. This is just a rewrite, not a rewrite, you know, not telling the same story, you know, this is a rewrite, so, you know, I, I like how, I, I mean, he did it very fastly, you know, taking him apart, you know. Taking out those, you know, those chakra rods, those chakra receivers, putting them into himself so he can feel it, feel Nagato's presence. I mean, he did that using stage mode, oh, but this time, I mean, he used it using ch Nine Tails chakra mode. I mean, with his chakra mode, it works the same as stage mode. He can feel, emo feel and sense things, but for chakra mode, it's on a much greater range, you know. Uh, he's a lot stronger, you know, uh, and he confronts Nagato. So, I mean, Nagato, remember, I mean, remember, between these guys, they both hate each other. They both blame each other because of what happened in the village, that village they, they went to when they first met three years ago, that each side blames the other for the village and for the privacy. You know, I mean, I mean, yeah, I mean, Nagato blames Naruto's village, you know, Naruto you know, and his village for destroying it. And because it, and and because of the loss of his friend Yahiko, Nagato changed, and he thinks Naruto blames Nagato's group because he believes they were responsible for the whole situation, and they were responsible for killing off all those people. But well, we all know who the true villain was, Orochimaru and stuff, and that he was truly responsible. And also shortly after that, that it it led to the argument between Sasuke and Naruto. I mean, you know. Uh, uh, but now uh, his words, you know, the same way, like after hearing, I mean, after they both heard each other's side of the story, it was Nagato, it was Nagato who began to change, because he believed that in this boy that he could find hope, you know, I mean, he tried his best to be Jiraiya's student, he tried his best to do, follow the right path, but he was led out such a dark path, such a dark way, that he ultimately lost himself, but when he sees Naruto, he's reminded of the self he could have been, the person he should have been, like the, the the person he could have been, the great, man. but instead he lost his friend, he got turned to the dark side, you know, kind of you know, dark Vader stuff like that, but, <laughs> but this is not Star Wars, this is Naruto, so, hmm. you know, hope I don't get copyrighted for that, you know, I won't get, I'll get in trouble for that either, you know, copyright, you know, you know YouTube's sensitive to copyright infringement, you know, stuff like that, I got flagged like a bunch of times, so. Anyway, the situation for them is, like, very dire, you know. You know, Naruto's words, he managed to get through to Yahiko, you know, to Nagato, you know, he managed to get through him, and Naruto, Naruto getting through to him, reminded him of his dead friend, and finally, you know, he undoes the Jutsu, saves the village, you know. Yes. But then, at least, but then, as they, as, but then things, you know, they're so auspicious, you know, after Nagato leaves with Konan, uh, everybody's, you know, is wondering what's going to happen, like, you know, oh, we got Minato talking to Fugaku, Sasuke's father and leader of the Hidden, Pol Hidden Leaf Police Force, the Uchiha clan. The situation for them, for him is dire. I mean, his son abandoned the village, and, and he realized his mistake, that he paid so much attention to Itachi, that he caused his own, uh, that he caused, 
caused his own son to abandon the village and turn his back on everything. And and this is and this is where the and this is where things get a very hectic turn. And Sasuke goes to Orochimaru, kills Orochimaru, Aru, Aru, and you know, now and he's taken, taken to the taken by the Akatsuki. He's awakened when he wakes up. He sees Sasori, telling him that you killed Itachi. And this is the same thing as what happened when you know, you no know, fake Madara Tobi after Sasuke first killed Itachi originally. Uh, but he made Sasuke join the Akatsuki and so he can take revenge on the Hidden Leaf. You know, it's all it's all, it sounds very simplistic as I say it, but you know, remember this is all a very complicated story. Even though it's just retelling, it's still complicated, but you understand it. Anyway, from the situation, it looks like Sasuke once again is going to square revenge on the Hidden Leaf. He's going to go after them. And it looks like and it looks like in the preview for the next episode, it looks like you know. Like, uh, the Shinok, it looks like, you know, uh, the Hidden Leaf decided to go after Sasuke and to stop the Akatsuki by forming a unit that could challenge the Akatsuki, because they're going after Jonin class Shinobi. That means they're going to need their best ninja to go after them. Um, I mean, this, I mean, so far they didn't mention nothing about any Jinjuriki's. I mean, so far these, uh, so far they've all, they've all, they've been sneaking, doing stuff behind the scenes. But I wonder how that's going to translate, you know, to the original story. You know, and this is all supposed to be a book, you know, a book written by Jiraiya, who's supposed to be his last novel. I wonder, how the hell Jiraiya knew all of this stuff if this was all, you know, before his death, you know. Anyway, that's all I got to say. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Comment, subscribe. Thank you. This is Tullo Banana. I'll give a nice view. Now it's just food in episode 448. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Comment, subscribe. Thank you.